Oh shit, now we've got to deal with Alfred. Alfred and his shakes. His possible PTSD shakes. I kind of hope it's that versus something like Parkinson's, you know? I mean, if they pulled that out on me, I'd probably lose my shit. I heard your discussion with Commissioner Gordon. Now he knows that Lucius Fox and the Batman are, were, allies. Gordon's dangerously close to figuring out who you are. I know. If he does find out, I have no idea how he'll react. It's not a chance you can afford to take. He looked me straight in the eye, Alfred. He's been our friend a long time. He deserves to know. I understand that, Bruce, but he's still too close for comfort. Yeah, but it's Gordon. I'm sorry, but he is. You were radio silent for so long. Tell me, did you find out how Lucius died? This is a missile I found in Riddler's workshop. The explosion at Wayne Tower. We were thinking about it all wrong. The puzzle wasn't an explosive. It was an emitter. When it was solved, it emitted a signal. You heard it earlier. If allowed to play too long, it becomes a launch signal. Dear God! You did solve the box. We just didn't know it. The Batcave Scrambler blocked the signal. Oh. Poor Lucius. Wayne Tower offered no such protections. Our tight little family has gotten smaller because of it. It was the three of us looking out for each other. Now it's two. With Lucius gone, we need to find someone to take over his role. No one could ever fill his shoes. Well, no. But, but you're right. Between the Lady Arkham affair and losing Lucius in this gruesome fashion, it's clear we're up against a new class of criminal. This war of ours, it may be too much for us on our own. That's why I'm up for telling Gordon, and also maybe getting Tiffany if she doesn't hate me. The list of agency operatives from Riddler's workshop. He plans to do the same thing to them. It's a hit list. It's only useful if he has a way to target the agents, though. And I doubt he's sending them all puzzle boxes. Hold on, let's just walk through it. Could you not just tie it into their phone numbers, by the way? I see what's happening, though. I think we may end up... So, you know, the, the agent, the psychological, uh, the psychiatrist agent, and also Vernon Blake. Also, thank you, those of you going, oh, Blake. Blake is from, uh, from Heavy Rain. His name is Carter Blake, but yes, uh, an annoying police FBI sort of guy called Blake. That's probably where I was going with that when I went, hmm. Um, we could, yeah. I think we're going to end up working with this woman because I don't know where else we can go. I could be, I could be very wrong, but of all the people, there are also, there are people in the comments going, oh, maybe she's like working with Riddler. It's totally possible. In light of Maury, she could be a mole. You know, um, so we're going to have to be very, very careful about how we do all this and who we pick if we pick anyone. It would be great if we could pick Tiffany and it's fine, but I don't know. Um, and then, yeah, this, I'm guessing the communications grid will, I'm guessing the missiles are going to trap the phones. He's hacked their cell phones. He could pinpoint the location of any one of these operatives. I mean... Surely you could just wait till they all go to work and then get them all at the same time. It would save on missiles, just on an economical villain basis. But, yeah, sure, whatever. And he can broadcast his signal through their phone to make them a target of a missile strike. Better put your phone on airplane mode. Can you block it? If I can get a clean copy of the signal, yes. Okay. That would be good, because it's not only going to kill those guys, it's going to take out a fair bit of Gotham and some civilians. Oh, my God. It's the only way I can get a clean version of the signal. No. It's pretty grim, Alfred. You don't have to watch. No. You could go if you want, dude. I can handle it. Oh, Alfred. I've never been one to shy away from duty, however unpleasant it may be. You are a rock, Alfred. I'm always able to count on you, huh? Even in the toughest times. 
The last thing I want to do is let you down. Alfred, you'd never let me down. Bruce, get my daughter out of the building. Get yourself out. What are you talking? What did you figure out? I've I've solved the Riddler's puzzle, Bruce. Lucius. He knew he was going to die. Yeah. Oh. Can you switch to audio only, please? Yes, Alfred, absolutely. I told you, Alfred, you shouldn't be here. Tell Tiffany that I love her. That I'm sorry I wasn't around more. Lucius? We really made a difference, didn't we? Batman? Uh, I, uh, I, I, I shouldn't have watched this. I'll, uh, I'll go get that tea. Master Bruce. Careful, Alfred, please. Look after yourself. All right. Now I just need to create a filter to get a clean version of the signal. Okay. And then match up the points found in both sound files. Sweet. So you get Audacity, it's a free program, and then you can like, audio filter noise out. It's brilliant. You just sample a bit and then it will do it. Fucking hell. Um, but right. So what... Bruce, Riddler, Enterprises, Tower, Disable, Bruce. How about if I link Bruce, Bruce and I link it to Bruce? Bruce. The waveforms match. <laughs> oh my god. Uh, Batman. And oh no. Where's Batman? Disable. I thought there was another Batman. Wayne, Tiffany. Tower. Riddler. Disable. Tiffany. Wayne. And, mm, Tiff. Hang on. Tiffany. There's two Tiffany's. There Tiffany. we go. Tiffany. Tiffany. That's a match. There. I've piggybacked onto Riddler's cell phone hack. They'll recognize any incoming signal match and shut down, negating a launch. Amazing. Great job, Bruce. Makes sense for me to have the signal on me as well. What for? Riddler still has functioning missiles. Once he finds out I've blocked his targets, he may decide to launch indiscriminately. But with the signal, I might be able to divert them. Tiffany gave me this the day Lucius died. Let's put it to good work. Oh my god, that's amazing. It's not a theory I really want to test. So we had better find Riddler first. Yes. There is always Riddler's second in command. Yes, there is. Eli Nabel, arrested after his attack on the casino. Enable. None of the authorities have gotten anything out of him yet. Is he seriously called Enable? <laughs> that's ridiculous. Oh shit. Unknown contact. What is it? It's John. That John guy from the funeral, from Arkham. Who actually sounds like he's keeping his word. Oh, another lead? Uh, why Maury? Maury, huh? John thinks that Maury can get us Riddler's location. You believe him? Maybe we should go back to the beginning. Maybe. Bring Rumi Maury up on the back computer. Either of them could potentially lead me to him. The question is, which is more likely to help you? Oh, uh, are we going as Batman? Oh shit, I don't know actually. Oh, we can read it before we commit. So, Rumi Mori, if you've forgotten, is uh, the arms dealer who's right at the start in the casino and Riddler turns up and is like, you've let me down. So, he has already been attacked within his own, like, security net. So, there may be an element of fear there that Batman can work with. But, Eli is in jail already. So, maybe more accessible. I don't know. Let's have a little read. Maury's a businessman. Given the right incentive, he could be persuaded to talk. 
You sure can't have any love for Riddler after his attempted murder at the casino. I'd say he'd respond better to a more genteel approach, peer-to-peer -peer as Bruce Wayne. However, the agency is watching him. If Waller finds out that Bruce Wayne sought a parley with Mori, she'll not be best pleased. On the other hand... That changes things somewhat, then, if I have to go as Bruce for that. But then Batman, I think we'll go with Batman at the police station. I will probably get harassed by Waller's little friends, but I think it's too dangerous to my reputation in like the fact that they're trying to work out who I am. So we shouldn't go as Bruce Wayne to meet him. Riddler's Lieutenant. Eli Nabel. Took a go at me in the casino. Put up quite a fight. Cracking him will be tougher, more physical. Certainly a job for Batman. He's currently in Waller's custody in a GCPD holding cell. Interrogating Nabel there would be a visible endorsement of Waller's authority. Gordon won't like it. No. Shit. Well, that's the question, isn't it? Oh, nice. That's the question. Do I piss Gordon off a little bit more? God. It's a risk. It's a huge risk with Maury. It's like, which do I value more? In terms of, like, reputation going forwards. I'm almost tempted to do schmoozy schmoozy Bruce because I don't want to upset Gordon any further. And I don't really want to endorse Waller. Fuck. Oh, sod it. Let's do schmoozy schmoozy. I'll meet with Maury. I'm sure Bruce Wayne can find a way to reason with him. Shall see. Ha! <laughs> ha! Oh, I'm gonna get in my silly car. <gasps> Definitely not the Batmobile in red. Don't tell anyone. Oh my god, Alfred. Please be careful. Just stay in the back cave where the signal can't find you and just live your, live out your days there, man. The Virago. Or the Virago. Oh god, is there a Oh no, I can just walk in, it's fine. Obviously I'm Bruce Wayne, so attendance list? Fuck off. Hmm. What should we play today? Oh, I've got my magic eyes in again. Waller's people are here, watching Mori. Riddler's agency data should make him easy to tag. I need you to keep an eye on him for me. Maybe cause a distraction if I need it. Okay. Who's this bitch? <laughs> hey. Gotta be careful here. Oh, good. All this attention must be annoying to a man like Mori. Oh yeah, he's over there. He's in the back. They're following his every move. I mean, they're a little bit obvious. I see them. All of these agents were on Riddler's list. Even without access to their phones, he'll still try to kill them all somehow. Do whatever it takes to find him, Bruce. I never want to see another video like the one with Lucius. Okay, I'll try, Alfred. No time to waste. This is a tiny challenge. But I'm gonna schmooze it. Hello! Mr. Wayne, to what do we owe this honor? Good evening, Mr. Mori. I've come to talk. <laughs> yeah, that's your cue to leave. Thank you. Thank you. Bye. Your visit is unexpected, Mr. Wayne. What can I do for you? A private matter between friends. Um, we have a mutual enemy. We have a mutual enemy, Maury. He can't go unchecked. Men like you and I have many enemies, Mr. Wayne. I am sure we share more than one. You know the one I mean. The authorities are watching my every move. Apparently, I'm a person of interest. There's really not much I can offer you other than a drink and a seat at the roulette wheel. Not while I'm being shadowed. Well, I'll see what I can do about that then. Bear with me. We need privacy. Lose the agents. Done. They just got an order to sweep the perimeter. Should give you a couple of minutes at least. Thank you, Alfred. Impressive, Mr. Wayne. 
<laughs> we haven't even scratched the surface. What can I do for you? Information about the Riddler. Why would I do that? Um, well... Your weapons killed my friend. You sold the Riddler weapons that killed one of my oldest friends. Lucius's blood is on your hands. That was never my intent. I'm sorry for your loss. There's an easy way to make up for it. <sighs> Come on. I dealt with that maniac, it's true. But I was done after the first delivery. Riddler wanted more. Everything he could get his hands on. He even wanted me to hand over one of my biotech companies. I said no. That's why he attacked you? You have no idea how crazy he is. I only wish I had known it sooner. I, I have a pretty good idea. Actually, I have a pretty good idea. I see that you do. He scared me. I was afraid he'd use my goods in the city. After the explosion at Wayne Enterprises, it turns out I was right. Yeah. I want you to know, I had no idea the Riddler had marked you as a target. I knew your father back when he was running Gotham. Our interests often aligned. I would never dishonor his memory. He was a friend, truly one of a kind. Then you owe me one. Then you owe me for my father's sake. <laughs> that was a long time ago, and favors go both ways. I can help you find the Riddler, Mr. Wayne. I sold him the missile array he's using to pick off his enemies. He won't be very far from it. Everything you need to find him is on that drive. Amazing. But I need a favor from you first. Okay. A favor? Walla has me detained here pending Riddler's trial. She controls all my accounts. I need to get out of the country and in all haste. You can help with that. Otherwise, I fear my fate is a short, miserable life in a black prison. Somewhere deeply unpleasant. I'm not here to negotiate, Mori. If you know where the Riddler is, you're going to tell me. Come on, Mori. Be reasonable, Mr. Wayne. We're businessmen. I can't give you something for nothing. Oh, dear. A chartered plane waits for me at the airport. The pilot will fly me to a safe haven in the Caribbean for the right price. All you have to do is authorize a transfer. You don't want me as an enemy, Mr. Wayne. Oh, God. I don't. Our agency friends will be back any second. Let's handle this quickly and without disturbance. Oh, fuck it. Go on, then. I've got cash. I'll get in trouble, but fuck it. Done. Send me a postcard from the beach. Thank you, Mr. Wayne. I owe you a great debt. If this ever comes to light, I'll keep your name out of it for as long as I can. Thank you. Be careful, Mr. Wayne. That lunatic is not to be trifled with. I know. No. I suggest you make yourself scarce before our agency friends return. Absolutely. Have a great day. Thanks for the info. Alfred, I've sent you Maury's information. Find me Riddler's location, and fast. The Lady of Dublin. Which is? A cargo ship in Gotham Bay. <sighs> Good. Send me the location, and let Gordon know. Tell him Batman's on the way. Batman is on the way. Yeah. I, I don't think I could have won that situation either way. The Lady of Dublin. Men on board. This must be it. Yeah, be I careful, reckon. Bruce. I will do. Who knows what the Riddler has up his sleeve? I bet you in like an episode or two, we're going to find out she's recorded everything on that drone, and it's like she's known, <laughs> and she's cross with us because we haven't told her. It's leading up to her working with us, so you know, we'll see. I'm a bit sad that Lucius never got to tell her, but that's the point. It's all strife and peril, isn't it? That's how you write a story. I'm on board, Al. Do you see Riddler? You won't get away with this. What do you think's gonna happen? Noise again, are we? 
agent. What was your name? Blake? I hear him. Need to get a better angle. Oh shit, it's Blake! You'll see what's gonna happen. My friends will all be here soon. Then you'll see what this is all in aid of. We you found him. The imbeciles really thought you could... Moria's information turned out to be accurate. Wallet. Yeah. So no sight of the missiles yet, though. They must be here somewhere. All your idiot colleagues, too. Then it's hard to blame. Hostages. They appear to be more of Waller's agents. The agency has a history. Does that mean that I'm slowly drifting forwards and that's not me? Um, does that mean that it's what's her face in this one since we can't see it? I'm guessing it's going to be like the turnaround and it's her. A good spot for cover. To get my revenge on your predecessor. Because Blake is her partner, so that would make sense if she's also here. You'll see what I mean soon, of course. Oh, hello. They might be angry I brought you here, but. When they understand why, they'll recognize my, my brilliance. <laughs> oh. After all, I am Wait for it. to see the big picture. It's often a struggle. Don't want him raising an alarm. People see that. I'll move when he is looking. I'm sure you can understand. But I get it. Sometimes my methods can appear a little unorthodox. You brought this on yourselves. All of you. You government clods really thought you were smarter than me. It's clear you're in desperate need of some schooling. Schooling. My friends will be here soon. I'd keep your mouths shut until then. Hostages first. When they're safe, I can find the missiles. Targeting online now. Ready, Bruce. I don't like this friends malarkey. Like, whose friends are... Oh, whose friends are turning up? Ooh. Let the hostages go, Riddler. You can't possibly think clunking a few heads is enough to make me roll over. It worked for some people. Sized vermin. How fucking rude. Batman. Batman. Is it her? Agent Avesta. The floor. It's heating up. Oh, for fuck's sake. Um, okay. Well, I don't know what you want me to do. Can I? Oh, I can open it. Oh, hello. Oh, uh. Thanks, Batman. Hi. Ooh. No! What are we doing? We're just falling. Ow! Are you all right? 